Going by the book. Mastering the art of following rules in English. Hello, dear viewers. Today, we're diving into the fascinating realm of English idiomatic expressions. These phrases add color and depth to the language, and understanding them is key to becoming fluent. In this episode, we focus on the phrase, to go by the book. Let's unpack its meaning, origins, and how you can use it in your daily conversations. The expression, to go by the book, is used to describe a situation where someone is following rules or instructions very strictly, without deviating from them. It suggests a methodical, by-the-letter approach where guidelines, procedures, or traditional methods are closely adhered to. The book, in this phrase symbolizes written rules or established conventional wisdom. While the exact origin of, to go by the book, isn't clear, it's widely believed that the phrase has legal or religious roots. In historical contexts, the book might have referred to legal codes or religious texts, both of which demand strict adherence. Over time, the phrase has evolved to be used in various contexts, emphasizing the importance of following established guidelines or rules meticulously. 1. In a professional setting, the auditor insisted on going by the book, ensuring that every financial transaction adhered to the company's policies. 2. In daily life, when it comes to baking, Mary always goes by the book, she never alters the recipe. 3. Metaphorical use, even in challenging situations, the captain of the ship preferred to go by the book to ensure the safety of his crew. Understanding when and how to use this phrase will help you sound more native and articulate in your English conversations. It's a phrase that conveys precision, attention to detail, and a respect for established procedures. While, to go by the book, is a widely understood idiom, there are variations or similar expressions you might encounter, such as, to play it by the book, emphasizes playing or acting within the rules. By the numbers, focuses on following a procedure in a step-by-step, -step, often mechanical manner. These variations carry a similar meaning but can be used in slightly different contexts or to convey a subtly different nuance. We hope you enjoyed unraveling the meaning and usage of, to go by the book, with us. Idiomatic expressions like this one are the keys to sounding like a native speaker and fully understanding the cultural nuances of the English language. Keep practicing, and don't be afraid to incorporate these expressions into your daily conversations. Until next time, keep learning and go by the book in your English language journey.